The debate over gender quotas in the Liberal Party has reignited by the retirement of a senior female MP in Victoria. Mary Wooldridge believes quotas are needed to fix the party's women problem, but the Liberal leader isn't convinced. After 13 years serving in Victoria's upper house, always on the Liberal front bench, Mary Wooldridge makes a gracious exit. I'll certainly be wishing my colleagues all the best for the election in three years' time. But not before delivering a parting shot. I think quotas need to be very seriously considered uh, as a genuine option. Uh, we do have good women who are putting up their hand for pre-selection. Uh, they're just not being selected at this point, uh, particularly at a state level. Ms Wooldridge raised the issue after the party's devastating 2018 election loss, saying targets had been set and ignored. And it was clear quotas are needed to ensure good Liberal women get pre-selected to run for Parliament. She says the Liberal Party's long-held pushback argument has always been merit over quotas. We do need to increase female representation. Uh, I'm not wedded to any one model of doing that. The man charged with bringing the party back from the 2018 bloodbath also not sold on quotas. But he insists... I'm the leader who introduced four new women out of five new faces in shadow cabinet. So I'd like to think I'm actually part of the solution, not part of the problem. Ms Wooldridge will stay on until her successor is chosen, likely by the end of February. While she would like to see a woman replace her, Ms Wooldridge says it's not the place of an MP to interfere with party processes, even if she wants those processes changed. Andrea Crothers, Sky News, Melbourne.